I'm going to walk you through how you do the prescribing review search in EMIS to populate your data for the review. So first of all, start in EMIS and to get to the search, click on the EMIS logo, reporting and then population reporting. Once you're on this page, you'll see down here the EMIS library. If you click on this, you'll then see a tab that comes up called workload analysis. And if you double click on that, it will open up these searches. And one of them you'll notice is called registrar prescribing. If you open that and then click on the search at the bottom here and click run, it will then take about uh, two minutes to run the search in your practice and that will depend on how many patients you have seen in the last few months. This will search for the last couple of months of patients you and any other registrar at the practice have seen. Once you have um, finished the search, what we'd like you to do is click on view results and then export. Don't click on this export, but you must click on view results then export to um, save that information. Once you um, have exported it into an Excel spreadsheet, you should open it and it will appear very much like this. So you'll have your patient EMIS number, you'll have the, the trainee or the registrar details here, the prescriptions, um, directions, etc. on this spreadsheet. So first of all, we just need to make sure that we've only got the one trainee rather than several trainees because it will probably pull up all the trainees in your practice. So to do this, you'd click on um, column C click on filter and then click on the trainee you only tick the trainee that you need so you want to untick all these other boxes so that it's just the trainee that you require click on OK and all the others will be removed we then need you to highlight the boxes so from the first box um, in cell A down to I and then as many as you need so you need at least 60 but no more than 100 so if you just highlight um, those, that information, copy that information, then you'll need to open up the GP prescribing Excel spreadsheet, which um, has been provided, which is the one that you need to populate, and it appears like this. If you then click on cell B1 and click paste, it will then populate the information into this spreadsheet for you, as you can see with the patient number, age, trainee name, etc. And then you can start using this to populate with ones and zeros, depending on whether uh, you agree or disagree, whether there were any errors as you work through the review. You'll notice at the bottom of this spreadsheet, there is a summary table. And then once you've completed all 60 of your prescription reviews, we would expect the trainer to, to go back and review uh, 20 of these to check that they corroborate. There's more information on the review itself and how to do it as a separate FAQ, but this is just how to get the information from EMIS into this spreadsheet.